This story is about what makes us who we are. This is a story about life and death and about the things that really matter. The majority of people will die needing good palliative care. The thing is though, nobody wants to discuss it, but avoiding this subject might be making it harder for each of us. There's a lot more in palliative care than people realise unless you go looking. We don't expect people who have a life-limiting illness to die alone. The biggest myth is that palliative care is only about pain relief. The earlier palliative care actually starts, the longer you live. What palliative care was 20 years ago is not what it is today. If people can pass in a way that they want to, is beautiful. By openly acknowledging the reality of death, we're actually better equipped to engage with life. When you have that knowledge that this is going to happen, it's so loving. The good news is that talking about death won't kill you. It's about making the most of the time that you've got. Not everybody that comes into palliative care goes out in the horizontal. After I got the diagnosis, I thought, to hell with this, I am not going to let this get me down. I will not be going quietly, let me tell you. To have those words that my mum wrote, it keeps me positive. I don't know, Mia, she must have done something. I think she deserves an happy ending. She might even see me out, I don't know. Be the person you want to be, live the life you want to live. <laughs> <laughs>